As artificial intelligence and deep neural networks have continued to become more and more integrated into our everyday lives, the race for enabling real-time intelligence on end devices, such as mobile and IoT devices, will define the future of computing. A diverse team of researchers at a variety of institutions have made dramatic progress in this quest for real-time AI at the consumer level. Our goal is to achieve real-time deep learning on off-the-shelf mobile devices, including the smartphones, the sensors, and smart cameras. So the real-time requirement means we need to achieve 20, 30 frames per second. Otherwise, it cannot deal with the video-based applications. And this cannot be done in the prior software framework. Because real-time AI is a processor-heavy operation, Many have considered hardware as the major constraint for enabling real-time intelligence on IoT devices. Dr. Wang and his team are challenging that view and have been drawing on a recent real-time AI optimization framework to solve the hardware problem. Our solution is a compression compilation co-design. So this is a reason that we got the name CocoPy. So the compression and the compiler-based code generation are performed in a hand-in-hand -hand manner in order to maximize both accuracy and hardware acceleration. For the compression part, it's mainly focused on a specific type of pruning. Pruning means that we are going to remove the waste and therefore remove the both the computation and the storage. However, the prior technique are either accurate or hardware friendly, but they cannot achieve both. Our developed pattern-based pruning is a novel technique that can assign a pattern to each convolutional kernel and train the ways on the specific pattern. After the pattern-based pruning compression, the output is a graph-based representation of the deep learning model. This is the input for the next stage, compilation. Using these graph-based representations of the deep neural network, CocoPy then uses a unique operation to group these kernels based upon their deep neural network patterns. The compiler then assigns each unique pattern to one strand, and each strand to one processing element. And in this way, both high accuracy and high hardware performance can be achieved in parallelism. So with CocoPy, it's the first time to achieve the real-time acceleration of major deep neural network applications on and off the shelf mobile devices. It can have wide applications such as the real-time image and video resolution enhancement and other enhancement techniques, recognition and detection, nature language processing, auto-driving systems and driver assistance. It can democratize the widespread application of the mobile and edge AI and should have a revolutionary impact and broad uses.